You guys ever wondered what original character designs look like for some of your favourite NPCs from the world of cyberpunk? Well today we check them out thanks to brand new images here in the internet from the many artists at CDPR. How's it going guys my name's DPJ and if you enjoyed this video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more cyberpunk on a daily basis be sure to subscribe. So cyberpunk has been getting a ton of negative publicity as of late but it isn't all doom and gloom when it comes to their game. Many aspects of it are incredible, whether you decide to play it long enough to see them though is a different story altogether. But today thanks to a recent publication of brand new concept images for the game, we can check out what some of our favourite NPCs originally looked like in terms of original concept character designs. All artists you can see the names of on screen as well as the art station page where all of these can be found will be linked down below. But credit to the artists for their amazing work and you'll see it within this video people. So let's check them out and firstly Padre, a guy who we meet real early on within the game. We see some of his original character designs as you can see on screen now. And man, this dude looks so much meaner. I do love this design if I'm honest. I think it looks way better than his original look. So how about Claire Russell? Yep, the girl who loves that smell of burning rubber and petrol. You first meet her within the bar at the Afterlife Club real early on in the game. You can go on to do races with and for. Well, her original design actually isn't too far off her final look. Just that she looks a ton younger originally. What do you think? Let me know. Also, I'd say the same about Meredith Sturt. She really does look much younger in these concept images. But I guess she also at the same time looks less aggressive and enforceful, which isn't what I guess they'd want her character to portray within the game. So to give her a bit of a rougher look, make her look a little older, and make her look like a dominatrix, as some of you probably know. So what about Oot? Oot Cunningham, Johnny's original romance. I know for a fact that she is a fan favourite even though what we saw of her in reality from the game was only brief. Those scenes will stick in the minds of many forever. But looking at some of her original designs, I actually wouldn't call this as even being Oat, not unless I was told. Personally I love this design but I'm so used to Oat looking the way she does in game, I refuse to believe this was her or was one of the original designs behind her but still it is a great design. So let's check out some of the original designs behind the character we play both male and female Vs. Starting with male. So personally I love this look and it gets better with that added cyber wear. Shame it doesn't really matter how we look though as for the most part we don't get to see our characters in game. But even if we did due to the character customization, our characters will never look like the original designs nor those that we see from the trailers. And it's the same with the female V2. I love both designs here. I actually prefer the one with the longer red hair, more so over the one we see in the trailers. But hey, that's just my opinion. But these are great. So how about Evelyn Parker? Again, someone we meet real early on. And although here I can see the similarities, I do prefer the Evelyn we see in game. There's just something about that kind of bald head haircut that really puts me off. But I guess it suits the style of cyberpunk even more which I couldn't disagree on, but still it's great to see these character designs. So how about Johnny Silverhand, the one and only, Keanu Reeves. I mean Keanu Reeves is Keanu Reeves, and I guess many people would argue he's perfect, but originally people he looked like this. And although this design here is amazing, and to me as weird as it sounds, he fits the leader of a band more so than what I think when I see Johnny Silverhand being portrayed by Keanu Reeves. Yeah I know that sounds crazy, but this dude just looks like a proper rocker boy. Also gives me that impression they had a real hard life, which is how Johnny is portrayed in cyberpunk. So yeah, I'd probably say this fits Johnny Silverhand even more, but Keanu is Keanu and you can't go wrong with him. And finally guys, one of if not the best NPC in the game, her name is Panam. Now Panam, I know many people think he's perfect and I've seen it, people stating she's perfect. The memes I have seen are absolutely hilarious, people obsessed with her, it's utterly crazy. I mean, I may be one of them, but hey, but her original designs, she looks 
much different. Now as you can see on the screen now, although she isn't a million miles apart, she does look a lot different, mainly due to how young she looks also, and much less worn. And I say worn probably because she's gone through almost 13 million romances and tank scenes if you know what I mean. But I do actually like this look for her. Her hair being the main difference with it being long, I think it suits this version but wouldn't suit the panel we have in the game right now. Design wise and the clothes are pretty much perfect here too and it's what they went with in game and if I'm honest this is the one NPC I would like to see more concept images of in terms of the progression from this Panam to the Panam we see in game right now. But yeah guys those are some of the tons of new concept images recently released by CDPR. Again a link to them all you will find down below. Some interesting ones there too I haven't featured today so go and check them out. Again credit to all the design artists for these amazing concept images. And on that note the end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed it leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more cyberpunk on a daily basis be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video I upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on the next.